after we've done a backlash check, we should check the bevel gear runout. So the bevel gear runout is the total deflection to either the flanged case half or the planed case half. Now we're going to measure this using a dial indicator on the back side of the bevel gear and we're going to measure the total sweep of the needle of the dial indicator. So we can just see what that looks like here. Put our dial indicator 90 degrees to the bevel gear to get the full travel, zero at our dial indicator and we're going to rotate through one rotation. So we'll start with this white dot here and we'll turn through and look for what our total deflection is. So we can see we're just getting to one thou Two thou, three thousandths, almost four thousandths of an inch. Now it's going to start to come back. And we would expect that by the time we get to our dot, we'd be back to the zero mark. So we can see that our total deflection or bevel gear deflection or run out is going to be 4,000.